So very basically, we we'll want to learn how to add notes, okay, to an already existing boat. So definitely, we will definitely take our distance where we we'll add notes. Um, mind you, we are adding this knot on the threaded part on the threaded part of this boat. So we must get our threaded portion, which is two D, and our D is twenty. That's diameter is twenty. Okay, so let's use two D plus plus ten. Okay, for the threaded portion, that is. 2 times d plus 10 will give you 50. So we use 50 for the threaded portion. Fifteen. Alright. Now the next thing is that at any point from this line we drew, okay? At any point, let's just take from here. Draw a straight line. Okay. All right. Now remember this elongation that we had here that we use from this our uh, boat head. See elongates or still maintain that elongation. We'll be using it. I'm trying to make mine tick so that you can be able to see it. Okay. Now we have elongated. Now how do we draw this boat? Knot? Now we know that our knot head most of the time is equal to diameter, which is um two. But we'll use the value that we're giving the question, okay, and which is 0 0.75. So we'll use 0 0.75 as our knot. So 0 0.75d will give you 15. So I'll put 15 and 15 this way. Then I'll join. Yeah. The same thing we did up here. I'm also going to repeat the same process here. I'll we'll place here. And I'll get to this one and then we'll cut up the same thing. Cut, okay. Right then intersect, you pin, and then get to this part here. And then you draw. We'll also do the same thing too for this part too. We'll pin here and then get to this part here. Okay. Now I'll do it on this side now. So we we'll just cut here. Put it on this side and then cut it. Okay. So once we've done that, that point we cut, we just pin. Then we get to this part here. And draw. Sorry, I'm not using a good compass. My compass got missing, so I had to improvise. Now also do the same thing too for this part here. Get the distance, okay? And then Cut down, place it here, they will cut. Okay, so we'll do likewise here to cut and cut. So using this same distance, okay, just pin here, pin this part, and then we'll draw the curve. Okay, as you can see, I've, I just pinned here and drew the arc. Pin here too, and then draw the arc. Okay. Now we we'll do likewise too for this part. So I'll pin, get the distance. Okay. Put here, cut, cut down. Then put here, cut it. Okay. I'll do likewise too for this part. I'll pin here, get the distance, cut. Pin to the side, and now cut it. Okay. See, place here again. This one that I just cut now for this new one. And I'll get to this part, and now draw the arc. And also pin here too. And get to this part and now draw the arc. Sorry, my work is kind of not so neat today, it's kind of rough. But definitely you must have a curve. After the whole thing, your diagram should look something like this. So this has to look like then you cannot go ahead and then trade this many other portion. If you want to learn how to trade, you can check in the description part of this video. I'll drop a link there. You can click and learn how to trade. So thank you guys. This is how you can easily construct a knot or add a knot to an already existing boat. Thank you for watching today's videos and see you guys next episode.